Okay, so the first thing you want to do is download Win32 Disk Imager. Download the image. All links in the description. Write the image to USB pen. And boom. Now to the serious bit. Plug the USB pen into your server. Boot it up. Make sure to check the BIOS settings to make sure that it's set to boot from the right USB device. Like so. Dun dun dun. Boot. Boot device priorities. Sand disk at stream. Boom. Save changes. Wait for it to reboot. And you should be presented with a XP and Energy boot menu. So it looks a little like this. So there you go. Now you press the install upgrade option. Select the first one, 4528 at the time of this video. There may or may not be a working newer version by the time you're watching this video. You have to look it up to see what it's what. And it'll start doing loads of stuff. If you get a few errors, don't worry about it. If you get some sort of kernel panic, it may be due to the fact that you have a DVD drive connected. If so, unplug that, and it should work fine.